So Hogwarts Legacy, the open world Harry Potter game that everybody has been asking for, is set to be coming out next month. And I am excited about this because this game I've been waiting for my entire life. Because I've played every single Harry Potter game, yet I've always wanted a Harry Potter game where I can create my own character and be able to do whatever I wanted to in Harry Potter's world. So yeah, I'm really excited about this game. I've actually been going out of my way to replay some of the Harry Potter games, as well as been reading the Harry Potter books, because I want to go back to that frame of mind as a kid enjoying Harry Potter, because I was a really big Harry Potter fan. Heck, I even dressed up as Harry Potter for Halloween one year. That's how much I loved Harry Potter. I mean, everything, Harry Potter this, Harry Potter that, I had to have it. Had the Harry Potter Lego set. I had the Harry Potter figurines and stuff like that. I was such a huge Harry Potter fan that it blew my mind. Watching the movies, reading the books, playing the games, playing with the toys and the figurines and the Lego figures. It was truly magical, pun intended. So I'm very excited about Hogwarts Legacy because this is the game I've wanted my entire life. But, of course, you have people on Twitter who believe that you are an awful person if you go out of your way to enjoy this game. Hell, they think you're an awful person if you enjoy Harry Potter, period. Because if you enjoy Harry Potter, then you are a supporter of J.K. Rowling and her transphobic comments. Now, I disagree with J.K. Rowling's comments about the trans community. Because I've met with a lot of trans people, and I can understand where they're coming from, with how they are being mistreated, with how they go about being trans, which is one of the most difficult processes a human being can go through, is not being able to accept your own biology, and have to transition into something else. It's a mental gymnastic that I'll never understand, but at the same time, I have sympathy for these people and how they are being mistreated and looked down upon in society. Hell, I've had friends who were trans that have been kicked out of their homes, who have been disgraced from their families and everything like that. It's awful, and that's why I support trans people and have went out of my way to help them any way that I can by, you know, donating to the Trevor Project or by letting some of them even come to my own home and stay. You know, that's the thing that I've been trying my best to do. But with all that said, while I disagree with J.K. Rowling's comments about trans people, I am still going to buy Hogwarts Legacy. Because here's the thing, people. I can separate art from the artist. You can enjoy Harry Potter while at the same time not agreeing with what J.K. Rowling has said. And me purchasing this game does not make me transphobic. Because I'm not buying this game to support J.K. Rowling. I'm buying this game because I enjoy Harry Potter. And because I want to support the developers that worked on this game. And of course you have idiots saying, oh, the developers already got paid for this. Which is bullshit because anyone who knows the gaming industry knows that developers rely on game sales. Game sales mean a whole lot because that determines whether or not this game could potentially get a sequel. And it also basically means that the company thrives. Yeah, companies thrive on game sales. That's how they stay afloat, you fucking morons. Now, here's the thing. You don't have to buy this game if you don't want to. But by boycotting this game, you're not hurting J.K. Rowling. You're hurting the people that worked on this game, and you're hurting the fans who want to enjoy games like this. Those are the ones you're hurting. So yes, you can label me as a transphobe or whatever you want. I know better. I know who I am and what I stand for. You don't. And I can spend my money on whatever I want. If I want to 
buy and enjoy Harry Potter, then that's my choice. I can enjoy this Harry Potter game and at the same time not agree with J.K. Rowling. But nevertheless, that's really all I have to say. This has been PC signing out and I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay awesome.